Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video. You catch me in a, a 2021 uh, Coachman Kingsham uh, QTR. Um, I've just come down to our local uh, caravan place, uh, caravan dealership. Uh, just to have a look basically these are the caravans that I'm interested in which is this one in particular um, it's a lovely layer I'll show you around it in a moment but also um, we're going to have a look at a Swift uh, Amberley uh, which is some um, uh, another one that we are really interested in um, Sarah's not with me today unfortunately but um, no doubt I will show her these videos later on and uh, we go from there but uh, this is the first one that I wanted to show you I'm going to put all the stats uh, for these particular caravans um, on the actual um, video as we're going around and uh, you can have a look as well as you know uh, make your own mind up whether you know the price that they're asking for this caravan is worth it and I think it is actually um, but uh, let's have a look quick look around the caravan um, the the pros and the cons and uh, we'll go and then have a look at the Swift Okay, so this is the seating area of the coachman. Um, the only uh, drawback with this one um, that I feel um, is that the seating area is compromised. It, they are short um, in the actual length here, um, but we have never, uh, we wouldn't have any intentions of using them uh, as a bed. Um, it's just me and Sarah now, so we wouldn't uh, use it at all. Um, I do like the, um, the actual kitchen area. Kitchen area is lovely, got a, a nice uh, flip up uh, table area there to extend the size of the actual pre preparation area there um, you have a three gas burner with an electric hob which is really nice and the splashback mm, there isn't really much of a splashback to be to be honest um, I do like the sink really nice looking sink and a nice tap um, some nice cupboard space not soft clothes on any of them I don't know about these ones here uh, no, none of them are soft clothes, um, but it is nevertheless a really nice little kitchen area. Uh, you have a Dometic fridge, which is really nice. Uh, a nice microwave. Hello. <laughs> and that's all seated, re seated really nice uh, on a preparation area there, which are also is for your TV. Uh, working into the bed area, we have uh, the day configuration for the bed. We've got a nice lot of room around you. Uh, so this would be ideal actually it really is nice uh, I don't know about the drawers uh, nice little drawers nice area wardrobe You've got the wet Alco central heating some nice cupboard space above nice hecky roof light and the bathroom area again really nice really nice and beautiful big mirror there hello <laughs> uh, and a lovely shower yeah i don't don't like these sinks i, I really don't like these sinks um but uh, anyway um so yeah um place for the tv there another mirror but uh, it, this actually feels really wide, um, this caravan. It's not an eight foot wide caravan. It's, um, I'm sure it's not eight foot wide. I will, like I say, have all the stats on this. This particular one is fitted with a solar panel uh, and a motor mover. Um, so yeah, this is a really, really nice caravan. Presented really, really well. Nice grill and a nice little oven. Really nice. Yeah, I do like this one. Yeah, really nice. The only thing I don't uh, particularly like, although you've got the door there, it's not a uh, what they call a barn or a stable door where it's split in two. But uh, yeah, it is a nice one. Just drop the key. So yes, yeah, really nice. Just the outside of this caravan is beautiful. It's really in good condition. So it's a 2021 anyway, so it should be in good condition. It's obviously uh, uh, a second hand one, but it uh, doesn't look like it's been used at all. It's in really good condition. Let's go and have a look at the Swift. So we're in the Swift. This is called a Swift Amberley. 
Um, it's a beautiful caravan. This is a 2019 model. Um, we're going to have a look around this one. It's, um, you know, really nice. Island bed as well for this one. Um, I, I, I actually do like this one more than I do like the Coachman, to be honest. Uh, but we're going to have a look around this one. This is also fitted with a, a solar panel. It's also fitted with a motor mover. Um, it's been presented really well. It's a beautiful caravan. Um, the only thing I really, I don't really like too much is the actual wood surface. And I'm going to show you that in a moment. It's that gloss um, uh, effect on it. So it will show fingerprints and stuff like that. So that I'm not too over keen on, but you know, cloth wipe, it's only me and Sarah, so it's not going to get absolutely covered in fingerprints and everything else. But like I say, Swift Amberley um, impression, impression i'm sure that's what it's called um so i'll take you around we can have a quick look at this one as well so this is the uh seated area um really nice bench seats you have got the table here uh the the chest and everything uh that comes out um the only thing with that is that obviously you lose that area there where someone can sit because this does obviously sit back out so you've got enough room for four people here and like i said to you when we was in the uh, coachman uh, with that particular one it's only me and Sarah and uh, the same would be here as well that it's only me and Sarah um, got a Dometic fridge uh, right underneath the sink uh, a few power points there uh, this is what I mean about this gloss wood effect you know it would leave finger marks um, but still it is really nice um, again they're not soft clothes They're not soft clothes. Small hecky roof light. You've got the Swift Command Sender uh, Center. Center. Try saying that when you're drunk. A little cupboard there, which is obviously your aerials up there, and a little bit of areas for storing stuff. TV area. Uh, for putting the TV and another cupboard space underneath that. That's a bit loose. That would have to be done. All in all, really nice kitchen. Again, three burner and an electric top. Nice little sink with a really nice looking tap. I don't like the fact that it's got the microwave over the top of the sink, um, but still, still nice lot of cupboard space in area. And down there, place to keep all your tins and everything and I would imagine keeping your knives and forks and stuff really nice go into the bathroom area now I actually particularly hello <laughs> I particularly like this type of layout I know Dan Trudgeon and his family uh, looked at something similar when they were looking for a new caravan and um, I think their reasoning for not buying it was the fact that Dan's quite tall um, and he would have a problem with um, laying in this bed with his feet touching the end of the uh, wall. Now, I am only five foot seven, Sarah's five foot five, so this would be um, okay for us. We wouldn't have a problem with this at all, with this layout. You've got a nice wardrobe there with the table in there. You've got a cupboard down there with a drawer to keep bits and pieces in and the same over the other side I'll just go over that side just open these doors properly that's it and you've got the cupboards above really nice and another wardrobe with the Audi wet central heating I think I called it an Alco, <laughs> wet central heating in the coachman, so do beg my pardon. But yeah, all in all, really nice. Um, got this cushioning effect here, which is really nice. And a place for your TV, if you so desire, in the bedroom. But yeah, I think this is a nice layout. This would certainly um, be okay for me and Sarah. Um, you have the storage underneath, which by the looks of this caravan, has a massive awning already with it and some other bits and pieces. Whether that's new or not, I don't know. I don't think it is because this is 2019. Um, but certainly is a lovely caravan. 
I do like this uh, middle washroom and it's got the actual toilet on the right side of the caravan so you're not emptying the toilet cassette into the awning that's the only thing with our coachman that we've got now is that obviously when you're opening the cassette toilet to change it it's uh, we're doing it actually into the into the awning a uh, really nice shower um, fully lined with a camel head shower and really that's um, all I can say on this it's beautiful ca uh, beautiful caravan really is nice if I was to have a choice I think I would go for the Swift but anyway let's um, wait until Sarah looks at it she'll probably kill me for coming up here but anyway I um, I get it into my head and I have to do this sort of stuff and uh, then Sarah tries to talk me down uh, because uh, really at the end of the day there's nothing really wrong with our well there is nothing wrong with our caravan it's just me I get it into my head and I, I need to uh, uh, itch the scratch uh, scratch the itch um, so anyway we're gonna leave it there I think like share subscribe please give it the thumbs up if you thought it was interesting and we will see you in the next one.